writing decimal expansion in a p by q form. Now it may just happen that you are given a decimal expansion, okay, which is uh, let's say for example in this case is express 0 0.003 where 003 is repeating itself in the form of p upon q where p and q are integers. So in these kind of situations, the answers are pretty simple and easy. What you need to do is first find out how many digits are repeating themselves. Right? So let's say in our case, what we have is 0 0.003 where we are saying that 003 or these three digits are repeating themselves. Okay? Whenever is there is a number of digit which is repeating itself, so we take 10 to the power of that number. Okay, so let's say in this case it will be 10 to the power 3 and that gives you 1000. So what you will do is you are going to multiply the given number by 1000. So let's say for example we say that 0 0.003 is equal to x. Okay, when you multiply both the sides by 1000, what you get is 1000x is equal to 1000 into 0 0.003. Three, or in other words, you have one thousand into zero point zero zero three, which gives you three point double zero three, and in this case, double zero three will keep on repeating itself. So you have one thousand x equals to three plus zero zero three point, which is repeating itself. But we know that the value of this zero point zero zero three is equal to x. Or in other words, we can just write this as 1000x is equal to 3 plus x. Take the x to the other side, you will get 999x is equal to 3. Or in other words, x is equal to 3 divided by triple 9 or 1 upon triple 3. And thus we have mentioned this number in the form p upon q, where let's say for 1 upon triple 3, P is equal to 1, Q is equal to 3, 3, 3, right? And both these numbers are integers. So we have expressed a given decimal expansion in a form of P by Q, where these P and Q are integers. You can do similar thing for other cases also. So let's say, for example, if I had to do this for 0 0.555 and so on. In this case, the number of digits which are repeating itself is 1, which is 5, right? So we are going to multiply this by 10 to the power 1 or 10 and solve this in the similar fashion. If you had something like 0 0.474747, then basically we have 4, 7 or 2 digits which are repeating themselves. So we are going to multiply this by 10 to the power 2 or 100, right? In similar fashion, you can solve any of these decimal expansion and express them in a form of p by q where p upon q are integers.